Hey everyone, this is Jim for SDC International Shipping. I'm back again with Rob, where I ask him questions about the international moving process, what's involved, questions that come in online, over the phone, so forth. Now today's an interesting one. This came in from the website. I work overseas for a government agency. Do you have any experience with moving government officials who are part of an overseas consulate? What's involved in this process? What do you offer? Uh, yeah, abs that's a great question. Um, that absolutely, we do that all the time. and But it differs by country. Um, however, it is really the same as any other international move in terms of the, the process, right? So door to door, we are going to have our team show up, pack, protect, wrap, you know, make sure everything's taken care of, uh, load into a container, if that's the case, ship across the, the ocean, and clear customs, and deliver. The only difference really in dealing with consulates is uh, the pay source. Sometimes the consulate will pay directly, sometimes uh, they won't. So th that's really the only difference. But the, the, the process itself is the same for a, a diplomat as it would be for um, you know anyone else other than uh, certain things can be shipped by a diplomat and, and, and clear customs by a diplomat that may not be able to be done by a just a general citizen. That's interesting. Would uh, automobiles yeah. happen to fit into that category? That's, yeah, that's, that's the one I'm thinking about. You know, there's certain countries where if you want to ship an automobile, I may advise against it mm -hmm. unless, in, unless it's a real uh, interesting circumstance. Unless the person is a diplomat, then they can bring a, a vehicle in certain countries, just certain certain countries. So. Yeah, yeah. That's interesting. Now, um, if someone's watching and they're interested in this kind of a move, then can they just contact you directly and get more information? Absolutely. If, any, if anyone is a diplomat working for consulate, and moving internationally, yeah, absolutely reach out to me directly. I'd love to sit down and speak about your needs and how you know we can uh, synergize and, and make sure things that uh, work out the right way. Great, great. Rob, thanks for your time. Um, everybody, if you're watching this video, if you're new to this channel, we talk about international move, international moving, different customs procedures, all of the above. If you enjoyed this video, like it, share it with a friend, subscribe to the channel, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks, Jim. Thanks, Rob.